Good news for all of you who live or commute through Woodville. The train track on County Road 8 that was closed after a derailment there yesterday now back open and things pretty clear. WFA 48's Nolan Crane, the first reporter on the scene yesterday, back out there again today. OK, I see a train moving behind you. Progress. Liz, Liz, that is exactly right. Rather than me talking about the good news, you can see the good news. This is the third train that I have seen in just the span of an hour right here on the tracks, County Road 8 in Woodville. So definitely a lot of progress, and this is only possible thanks to dozens of crews who spent long hours last night to clear the 26 cars that had derailed. Yesterday in this same area, there were several cars that had spilled thousands of pounds of coal. Definitely a big mess for them to clean up. But as you can see, there is a train on the track. It is moving. But when the train moves, there's still a lot of debris that needs to be cleaned up. And we spoke with one man who says it seemed like a nightmare yesterday, but he's happy with the progress that he's seen. Here's Doug. So far, I'm amazed. They, they said 24 hours and they beat that. They worked through the night and got the silk screen up to keep the, any coal from migrating this way. So I'm quite happy with it so far. And Doug was the only homeowner who had any damage when more than 50 trees on his front yard were destroyed as the runaway train came smashing through and hit those trees. But once again, you can see the train on the tracks, progress being made. So definitely some good news. And get this, it only took less than 30 hours for crews to clean up the train derailment. Reporting live here in Woodville, Nolan Crane, WAFF 48 News. That really is amazing time. Thank you, Nolan.